what I really want to talk about today is our contract. I try to talk about it with people and they get bored. <laughs> They're like, I don't want to read section six of the, of the Arizona purchase contract. It's boring. But to me, it's critically important. I'm going to give you an example of what I've dealt with this week, okay, to kind of get an idea of how important this really is. In the contract that we go, we have what we call due diligence. We have a 10-day inspection period. You go, people go, yeah, 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 I'll figure all that out. Well, I've had several situations here just in the last 10 days where critical information, especially about value. What is the fair market value of a home? It's what a, a buyer wants to pay and a seller wants to sell. In an appreciating market, we see many instances where you can see a buyer reach above the appraised value or say, oh, it's so red hot. Look at all these other homes for sale. This is a great deal. But you know what? Maybe it's not. You have to dig down deep into what's really the, the bricks and mortar of what that entity is that you're selling to make an understanding of what fair market value is. An example. Sold a home. It, it was a, it was a condo, and it was all the other condos in that in that complex were just amazingly priced, fully remodeled. This one not so as much, but still very nice. And that's it was a great deal. We got a great deal until my client, who was amazing, that he saw that he's got a spatial awareness that I don't have. He's like, it, it's it's different than the others. The staircase is different, and this is a little bit different. It's Great. You know what? Let's make sure if we have a doubt that we check it out. Had it measured? Had it appraised? It's a different model. Tax records were wrong. I've had multiple situations this year with wrong tax records. And people are just saying, oh, this is a square footage, and they're taking it from the tax records. That's an ethical and correct thing to do. But what if the tax records are wrong? Because with a surging economy and all these things that are going on, those mistakes happen. So then what? What happens in two years when you find out that you have the wrong size home and, oh, you really overpaid significantly for something? So the due diligence aspect is so important. And having someone who's been, unfortunately for me, through the grindstone time and time again with experience of understanding what can go wrong and turning that into a positive is critically important. If you ever want to go through the contract and understand this, I'd love to talk to you about it if you, don't, if you don't get bored like everyone else. I just wanted to share that with you, how important that is. Our YouTube channel, as you can see down below, click on it. We've got a whole series, educational series, on the contract. I take section by section. I explain it, and I give examples of what it means to you and how it makes a difference. Mm -hmm.